Okay, uh, CBT lesson for, I don't know if I'm going to say your name right, brother, Anand Viki. And uh, this is Great White, House of Broken Love. What a cool song, man. We've got a lot of emotion to this. A um, lot of leads. It's nine pages. I have everything written on the tabs as far as um, techniques that are involved in this. So you'll be able to, everything's explained. I've subgrouped things. Um, it's over 30 subgroups. And you can actually subgroup them smaller than that if you need to. And uh, I say we jump right into this. The effects primarily used in here is reverb and delay. I can hear a little bit of coursing um, on some of the clean channel rhythms, like through section one and two. Um, so I say we get started, man. Let's, let's jump right in. And you want to tune standard for this. And uh, here's what you got. So for, for the beginning, the, the two chords are A minor 7 and G major here. And um, there are parts where the guitar will come in and play a couple notes through some of the verses. I kept the rhythm through there. Um, but all the primary lead stuff is all in there, which is the majority of the song, really. Um, you would have this. is is A minor 7 we're starting with um, middle finger 2D first finger 1B make sure your knuckles are shifted up so we can clear this G string string number 3 you gotta make sure it's not muted so your picking is um, 5 4 3 2 on your strings A D G B leave everything down you don't wanna it's an arpeggio so everything stays in place and then we switch to G major, he just strums it. 3E, middle finger, 2A, first finger, 3B, third finger, 3 high E with your fourth finger. It's the four finger G major. And we just strum that. And you have a rest, it rings out. That is section one, it goes four times. You can pick everything down on this. Okay, then, uh, distortion comes in. And this is subgroup number one. Some of them are really small subgroups and some of them are a little bit bigger. And uh, he's starting on fret five on the A. The rhythm is still being played behind it, that A minor seven to the G major. And uh, so we're sliding from five to seven. That's a whole step ascending slide. And then uh, we're catching the seven on the D string after that. And that just rings out. Okay. Um, that's 12 seconds to 19 seconds, so obviously that slide rings for, or that final note rings for a while. You just let it ring, you'll have a rest there. Subgroup number two, 20 seconds to 24 seconds is this. It's kind of a longer one, but it's four seconds, but there's a lot of notes in there. And we're starting third fret, 7G. And you're going to uh, bend that a whole step, two frets, bending the D note to the E note. Back it with a couple fingers to help strengthen that bend. Palm mute, all the rest of this, actually almost all the rest of it. Five, seven on the G. And I put the fingering down as well on your tabs for everything. Seven, five on the, or seven on the D. So, you got to shift that third finger up. 5, 7, 8 on the G, and then 5, 7, G, so, seven D, five G, seven D, so that's all palm muted, um, you know, the bend isn't, but, Five G, first finger quarter step bend. You'll see the arrow with the one fourth fraction, just a slight bend, which are used a lot in blues. Seven five on the D palm muted. So, like even that can be a subgroup. But and then five D, we're gonna pick that and do a hammer on to the seventh fret. So pick and slam it down. Uh, the 
third subgroup. This is uh, 25 seconds to 29 seconds is this. Then that just rings for a bit. It's only four notes. 5D, 7A palm muted, 5G, 7D. Just pentatonic riffs. This is in the key of A minor, all this solo. That's a subgroup. Okay, um, we move into subgroup four. This is 30 seconds to 36 seconds, and that goes like this. I'm gonna bring the gain up just a hair. Okay, so um, on that one, that's seven G, whole step bend. Remember to back it with a couple fingers for the bend. 5, 7, G, 7, D, so we shift the finger up. It's like I'm kind of flattening it, then shifting the knuckle up. Five, seven on the G, so. And then hit that seven G again, we're gonna slide to nine. Then we're gonna go eight, 10 on the B, eight, 10 on the E. So if you went from the slide, you'd have, oops. Pick the 10 again, slide it to t uh, 12, and then 10B. Vibrato. When you vibrato, it's a good idea a lot of times to bra brace the thumb here. And it comes from the wrist. Let's play that whole riff. Okay, um, we have a rest there, and then subgroup five is 37 seconds to 42 seconds, and that goes like this. Um, so the tenth fret on the B, you'll see a parentheses around it. It's a gliss slide. You don't really hear the ten. As soon as you pick, slide it up to 17. And then we're going to bar down to 17E, or knuckle shift, back to 17B, 20B, whole step bend, back it with a couple fingers. This can stay right where it's at, drop that down. And then stop the bend with the pick, come back down, bend it again, vibrato. As it's uh, holding, pick it, then release it. So we have... Then we move to page number two and finish it out with 17G, 20B, whole step bend release, 16G, so. Subgroup six is 43 seconds to 45 seconds, a real short one here, and this goes like this. Third finger 12D, slide a whole step to 14. Go 12, 14 G. Middle finger 13B, quarter step bend. Real slight. And then 14 G twice. So we have. Or, slide it to a round fret nine. Once you get over the nine, just set your hand over the strings. Subgroup seven, 46 to 50 seconds, goes like this. Middle finger, 12G, slide to 14. Oh, actually, yeah, so slide, 13, 15B. Pick the 15B again, do a bend, release, bend, hold, release. And start to release it. So, and then we have section two, which is similar to section one, but he's playing it different. He goes. Just two times. So it's the A minor seven, like the beginning of the song. 
But instead of going, we're going to go A, rest, strum, strings, 4, 3, and 2, then the G major. And that goes twice. That's 50 seconds to 55 seconds. Uh, subgroup 8 is 56 to 58 seconds, so it's only uh, four notes here. You'll go like this. Palm mute 7A, palm mute 5D, 5G, no palm mute, 7D, vibrato. And then 4G, half step bend release. Actually, that's part of the subgroup, so we have subgroup 9, 59 to 101 as far as the second, so that's a repeat of the first four with no palm muting. Then we're going to do 7G, slide to 9, and then 7G, 8B, hit them both. So you'd have... One more time. Pretty cool. Subgroup 10, a minute 2 to a minute 4. Um, 7A, palm mute, 5D, palm mute, pinch harmonic, 5G, 7D, so, oops, remember for pinch harmonics, you can get them in different tones by moving it, but usually right in the center is, the, is where people are hitting them, so that would be, uh, that would be uh, 8B, whole step bend release. I'm backing it with a couple fingers, so. Vibrato. Subgroup 11, a minute 5 to a minute 10 is this. So 5E, 5B, and then 8B, whole step bend. I back it with all the fingers and then vibrato. Okay, then we move to page three. This is still part of the subgroup from a minute five to a minute ten, and that goes like this. Actually, there's a pause. Five E, five eight B, so kind of shift it. And then 7G with the third finger. 7D, you want to shift the finger up. And then 5, 7G. 7D. 5G, quarter step bend. And then 7D. You'll see the, the picking for that as well. I just realized the ups and downs are notated in your tabs. Subgroup 12, a minute 11 to a minute 12. This is just a one second little riff. That's 7D twice. 5D, 7D, or 7A. Pinch harmonic, 5G. 7D, vibrato. So we have. Subgroup 13, a minute 13 to a minute 17 is this. And that's 5D, quarter step bend, pinch harmonic. And you're actually going to pinch all these. Like, it'll go. Again. So pentatonic stuff. 765A after the 5D of course. 3534 on the A. And then 5D slide to 7. Subgroup 14. A minute 18 to a minute 23. And this is. Oops. 579. One, two, four on the fingers, palm mute, alternate pick. Five, seven, nine, five, seven, nine. Down, up, down, up, down, up, palm muted. Seven, B, pick, hammer to eight. And then go 
9G, so... When you get to the B string, no palm mute. And then 7, 8, 10 on the B. 7, 8, E. 10, B. So it's... Seven, eight, ten on the E, slide to twelve. So So I slid up to twelve, and then we're gonna go fifteen high E twice, pinky, and then we have this. So you'll end up doing the fifteen B with the third finger, fifteen E with your pinky. Back it with the middle and the index right behind it. We're going to pick them both and bend only the B and then whammy bar. Subgroup 15, a minute 24 to a minute 17. 17E, 17B, 20B whole step bend. Then we have some natural harmonics. It'll be. Alright, so natural harmonics, 5th fret D and G go right above the silver fret bar. And then 5B, then you do the whammy bar down, so it's... Okay, then uh, 17G. 20B, bend release, 16G, no wait a minute, my bad, after the harmonics, then we go to page 4, my bad, and that is uh, back to uh, section 2, two times, that's the clean stuff, which would be the, uh, that goes twice, Second, and that's a minute 28 to a minute 33, Back to the solo, and this is going to be, um, well, let me play it for you. It's going to go. Oops. 15E, 1213B palm mute, and it's usually a little harder to palm mute on the B string, so make sure you're not going. You want a good palm mute there. 13E, 1213B, 12E. So we have 12, 13, 15, 13 on the B. 12G twice, slide to 14. So we have. Then we're back to section one. That was the very first part of the song. It goes four times. Right, and then uh, four times of that and then section three comes in this is two times a minute 52 to a minute 58 it's a D minor 7 to a C add 9 it goes all right so open D 2G bar the first fret on the B and E make sure that knuckle is up go 4 3 2 1 and then C add 9 3A, 2D, 3B, 3E, and strum. Strings 5 through 1. Does that twice, then it goes to section 1, which was the... Two times. Section 4 comes in at 206 to 26, or 205 to 216. It's F major bar. Let me play it first. So F major, G major, A minor 7, C add 9, G major, A minor 7, and then this part, 1E, 3A, 3D, there's two guitars, one just rings like a chord, like a, but the primary guitar behind it's going, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, so 12 times of and your palm muting the top three strings. 
Yeah. Move it to the three five five. Do it six times. All right. So we have. Oops. Into the G major. You have to transition from that to that. Okay. Then section or subgroup seventeen is going to be on part two.